Hey, this is Dean here from RecaMedia.com. In this guide, I will be showing you how to set up Facebook Business Manager and create an ad account. Welcome back. If you are a marketer or if you want to promote your uh, social posts on Facebook, then you need a business manager to do so. First of all, you must have a Facebook account, of course. Next, you need to head on to the business manager portal, which is this website. Links will be provided below the video. So as we said, this manager will help you manage ad accounts, your pages and the people who work on them all in one place. And it makes it easier for you to manage all the things related to your Facebook pages, groups, ads, etc. Good. Next, we need to click on login. So as you said, you must be connected to Facebook. So you need to connect using your Facebook account. After creating your business manager, you will be redirected to the dashboard. You can also add more admin to the, ad, uh, the business manager. So you just click on add and add other employees or admin access just by adding an email at the top and click on next. Well done. So what we need to do now in order to uh, start promoting pages or creating ads, we need to create an ad account in order to have these options. To do so, we just click on add accounts from the bar here on the left. Just click on add accounts. And as you can see, there are no ad accounts yet. And we need to create one. To do so, just click on add. Here there are some options. You can add an ad account if your clients have already have ad accounts. To do so, they just need to create an ad and provide you uh, with the link. Once you have added an ad account in Business Manager, you can remove it. You can add an ad account if your business will control campaigns and billing for this ad account or your client's account. This is useful for your client's account if you or if you work for an agency and you should request access to your client's ad account instead. So just head on to their pages, create an ad and give you the ad account ID in order to place it on this box. Then you click on add. Second option is to request to an ad account. It's the same, we just select a page and you request the admin of this page in order to add you as an administrator. The last option which is to create a new ad account, that's what we will be doing. And that. So first of all you need to write in your name. Next, you select the time zone and the currency that you will be using. After filling in all the information, you just click on Next. Next, you need to decide for what or who will this ad account be used for. By selecting this, will help Facebook decide whether this is a business ad account or it is a personal or individual uh, private uh, ad account. So make sure you select the right one if you are creating it for uh, your agency. So you just select my business. Otherwise, if it is for your agency and for your clients, so just make sure you select another business or client and select the partner in here or just connect using the business ID. If it is for private personal use, so you just select my business. Next, you just hit create. www.rackmedia.com Well done. 
your account has been created you can add people and set permission manage campaigns view performance manage add account and give all the information well done assign under X access next you click on assign and that's it so that's your the id of your facebook ad manager and it is added to your business account use this account you will need to select the payment method if you need to set up a new payment method you go to payment we'll show you later how to set up this well done as you can see the ad account is created and here it is for this business manager well done now we need to head on with set to payment great don't have any payment methods yet you can add payment methods here you can uh, add your credit card so you have the option to add your credit card next you click on continue and it will be set up and from this you can pay for your clients and a tip here is that you pay for all the expenses directly from your credit card and avoid going through uh, Facebook uh, services in order to earn extra points in your credit card and also in order to reduce the price for your clients and avoid them extra charges from Facebook so just pay the amount and get it later from your clients well done now we'll head on to add a page in order to do so we head on to accounts from accounts we have pages as you can see here we have one page which is already set up in order to add pages on this box you just head on to add a page as if you are the admin of these pages if you are not then you need to request access to a page or also you can create a new page for your business if you don't have any pages yet so we just uh, create add page search for the page you want to add in here so for example rock deals well done next we hit add page wait a few seconds and the page is added successfully since you are the page admin of this since you are the page admin on this page your requests have been automatically approved and as you can see it has appeared on our list that's concerning the uh, page if you have finished with your clients ads or services and you want to remove you just hit remove the page from the top in here well done and that's it now you have created your business manager and your ad manager and all you need to do is just to add a credit card into this ad account and you start selling your services and creating ads for your clients and for your business too keep tuned for our next tutorials in which we show you how to verify your domain and get approved by facebook Till then, this is your host, Izzedin. Peace. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, do consider sharing it. Click on the like button and go ahead and leave us a comment below. We'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and the notifications to get the latest tutorials that will inspire, empower, and connect you www.rackmedia.com